Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Nani3131. So it is 5.30 a.m. and I am here at the Northwest's largest garage sale and it actually started at 5 a.m. just for the people that have spaces here. The general public does not start coming until 7 a.m. Those are the early birds and then the very general public comes at 8 a.m. But the dealers can shop uh, starting at earliest 5 a.m. And can you believe it or not, I'm getting a late start. <laughs> I wanted to be here at 5 a.m., but it's 5.30. So I'm going to go in and show you what it looks like before the general public actually comes into this huge, giant garage sale slash flea market slash spaces, sales, all of that. So, all right, let's go on in. All right, it is 6 a.m. here at the Northwest's largest garage sale. Um, my area is not very organized. I just have not had time. I have a $2 table here. Some items thrown on a table and this scary mannequin. Hello. All right, so I will show you what it's like before the general public comes in. This is a time where all the dealers can shop and get a good deal before the general public comes in. Not every space is open. And this is the main building. Oh my gosh. We have an old train that you used to be able to ride probably at the grocery store. of items. See, not everyone is here as early as I am. There's another interesting item. Gas pumping tank. And the prices range from space to space. It could be anywhere from 50 cent items to $750 items. And over here, we have a space where everything is a dollar. If the booth is not open, there's nobody manning the booth. Please stay away from it. I know you want to buy something, but... Here we have a lot of spring and summer decor because summer is around the corner. Oh, goodness. And a gnome section. I love, love gnomes. I might have to get a gnome. I might have to come back. Very cute. All right, we're going to take a sneak peek into the second building that I showed you yesterday, which is mostly empty, but now it is completely full. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
Okay, I'm now going to take you into the third building of this sale. And this sale is huge. As you can see, there's a variety of stuff. Some people just throw things on tables and you just kind of have to dig like a crazy garage sale. Some things are just very organized. And everything priced accordingly, prices range. All right. It is 7 a.m. That means the early shoppers are coming in. They paid an extra amount of money to come in and shop an hour early before the general public comes in at 8. And they're coming in to find some deals. The Northwest's largest garage sale. You can see they're all coming in. The general public will be coming in soon to the Northwest Largest Scribe Sale. I'm here in my space waiting for the crowds to come in. It's going to be crazy. All right, it's still morning time, and as you can see, the crowds are here, and this place is packed. So many people, and the sale goes until 5 o'clock, so as you can see, the crowds will continue to come until later on in the day. All right, it is 11 o'clock at the Northwest Largest Scribe Sale, and the crowds are even larger. I think everyone has woken up, and they're out shopping. So I'm here selling. I've made over $100 so far, and I have until 5 o'clock to be selling in my space. So we will see how I do, and I'll keep you updated. All right. All right, so I am finished. It has been a long day, about 13 hours, and I made a few hundred dollars, so not bad. You know, I made about a couple hundred dollars profit, so around a hundred dollars of two days of work. So it's, you know, average, and I got rid of a lot of stuff that I've been holding on to or couldn't sell in my antique space or online for whatever reasons. So anyways, if you enjoyed this video, definitely give me a thumbs up. And if you want to watch more videos of mine, definitely subscribe to my channel. And if you want to never forget to watch my videos or to remember watching my videos, ring that bell. So until next time, see you later. Bye.